If you have been following me for a while, you know that I'm a big advocate of creating the necessary habits that are going to take you from A to B, from where you are to where you want to be. That rhymed, but let's continue. Anyway, um, and if you know anything about habits, you know that it's a bitch to implement. It's a bitch to implement a new habit because it takes up so much energy, so much willpower, so much, you know, yah. And previously, my approach was I'll just grind it out, try and just do the thing over and over again. But you always hit brick walls because of ego depletion, which is a theory that says that we have limited willpower reserves. I'm sure this is an idea that we can all resonate with. At the beginning of the day, we usually are high in energy and able to do a lot of things. But as the day goes on, you know, our willpower goes down and we just want to chill out, watch some Netflix and chill. But if you really want to form a new habit, you need to have a different strategy. You can't keep doing the same thing that everyone else is doing that doesn't work, all right? You need to think of smarter ways to use your willpower, which is a limited resource, as we said before. And the best way I can think of is through changing, changing your environment. Now, let me explain this idea to you guys. Let's say you want to start a new habit of jogging every morning and increase your cardiovascular health, right? So you generally would set your alarm for maybe 7 a.m., you know, get up, maybe make your breakfast, and then go out and start jogging. You see, there's a lot of points here where you can actually just stop the habit immediately because of the requirement of too much willpower. You could stop it right at the beginning, again up in the morning. It's a lot harder to get up in the morning than at daytime as we all know so maybe so jogging in the morning and jog a bit later in the day or if you're gonna wake up in the morning maybe put an alarm clock on the other side of the room so that when it rings you get out of your bed and that's already half the battle done you're out your bed and you're ready to go another roadblock is making your breakfast once again this takes too much time too much willpower and this can give you an excuse to stop right there and not even jog in the first place perhaps you can make your breakfast the night before and just heat it up and have it maybe some oatmeal with some milk or something or maybe you just skip breakfast altogether get rid of the roadblock and another thing is walk into the other side of the house to get your jogging shoes so you can go and run now nah, don't do that too much willpower get your joggers right next to your bed so as soon as you get out of bed you see them you put them on and you get out the door so you need to think of smart ways of using your willpower to initiate the habit you don't want to use your willpower for the habit because you just won't be able to do it. you hit roadblocks so this is just one strategy that you guys can implement hope you got something out of this video peace